Boom, welcome back to the channel. I'm Hank Strange, this is Stranger Palooza. And if you can't tell from all these Class B vans surrounding us, we're at Sunshine State RV, and my friend Nick Schmidt is here. Nick? Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you. Uh, <laughs> okay, you want to explain what's happening here real quick? What do you mean? It's a new year. Chili cook-off champion. Oh, this? I wear this every day. This is just right. something that I, that I won at our annual chili cook-off. I just... You're not so, used to people wearing their, their some br their some aprons? bragging is about to go down. This look at this. That's size matters, Nick. I, no. I mean, look at this thing. It says okay. chili cook off, chili wow. cook off champ. That oh, was me. Sunshine State RV. Well, I mean, we got a lot of employees here. Lots of lots of people submitted their chilies, and I happened to be the champ. Really? Yes. I think they were being nice to you. I don't know. I wasn't, I wasn't a so judge. So it was a blind test. I wasn't a judge. It was blind. There was uh -huh. all the chilies lined up. It felt like there was like a hundred of them lined up. Right. And everybody tried every one and they put and their you little, won. The little token. There. No one knew it was mine. Okay. It was honest okay. and fair. All right. Congratulations. Congratulations. Why? Steve. Why? Thank you. <laughs> but happy New Year, Hank. Happy New Year. I like your new gear as well. Oh, thanks. Check that out. This Van is our sure. winter fun. Look at that. There we and go. You know what? Crazy enough. Check it out. There's a ProMaster in there. Oh, there you go. Yeah, and we're going to talk about ProMasters. Are. These are from Road Trek. Road Trek. These yes, are from Road Trek. Road Trek has been making Class B since 1970s. Right. I don't think we've first... done a Road Trek video in a while. It has. Yeah. <laughs> it's definitely been a while. Yeah. What's What's cool is we're mm -hmm. actually, the Tampa Super Show is in two weeks. Yep. Hank Strange and Lola will be there for the week. Yep. I will be there for the week. Yep. And so will all these beautiful road trucks. So will these vans. So yeah. we're giving everyone kind of a preview here. Uh, road Trek's got a cool new color. They do. They do. They got some new on. options, some yep. new cool colors. Yep. Some new inside, outside stuff. So, you know, I thought, I said, Hank, we got to do something showing all of these with, with all yeah. this cool stuff. So. Yes. And you guys get to tell us what you think about it, what so, you think about the colors, interiors. So, Tampa Super Show, you're going to be there. Yes, I'll be there. When are the dates for that? Do you know? Uh, I don't know. Well, me, <laughs> I hope you let know. Let me look on my phone here to uh, see. It's soon. <laughs> January 18th through the 22nd. There you go. <laughs> we will be bringing road treks yeah. there. We'll All be right. bringing Coachman Novas there. Yeah. And we will be there for the whole week. Yes. And Lola and I will be there. And it's the biggest RV show in, in the, the world. world. It really is. It's yeah. stinking huge. Yeah, it, it is. It is huge. Are we going to so, do some kind of meetup or something? Uh, probably, yeah. We'll do so, We'll do a meetup. Where are you guys? Are you Road trek. You're going to be, you're going to have road track. And Coachman Nova. And Coachman. There you go. So if you guys want to check that out, you can Tampa, meet us at the show. Tampa Super Show. Yes. We'll give more details. We'll talk about it more here in this video. And we'll give you guys a chance to take a look at these uh, very cool vans that we have from Road Trek and their color schemes and tell us what you think about it. Let's get all up into it right now. Hey everyone, a new Vanasaur t-shirt design is out, just in time for the winter season. It's called Winter Camping Fun. Even here in the Sunshine State, it feels a lot like winter. If you're a fan of outdoor life, then this is a great way to give someone you care about a gift or get something for yourself and support this channel at the same time. All you have to do is follow the link here on YouTube, just below the video description to the Stranger Palooza store, where you will find this Winter Camping Fun design and other fun, cool Stranger Palooza gear. All right, Nick, so let's uh, get into the Road Trek. Uh, these are all Zions. What's yeah, the, what's so, the so Hank, something pretty cool about Road Trek. Mm -hmm. In 2015 here at Sunshine State RVs, maybe 2014, Road Trek came to us and said, hey, we love what you guys are doing in the used Class B market. We really want you guys to represent us in new Class Bs. And so it was, it was quite the honor for us to have the biggest Class B manufacturer ask us to sell their stuff. Yeah, that's a big part of your story because you guys oh, were selling used We were strictly that. selling used for yeah. 10 years before that. Then we get into, in 2014, we get into the new Road Treks and then it's just kind of exploded from there. So very thankful for Road Trek for, you know, kind of giving us a shot. Mm -hmm. Small dealership in Gainesville, Florida. Right. Who <laughs> just sold used Class Bs and now we we're selling Road Treks, which was like going from from you know nothing to the top type thing right and and uh yeah no we were really proud of that and then now since then we've taken on coachman and winnebago and american coach and all you know mm -hmm. all all these other class b brands and turn into the number one dealership in the state of florida for class b rvs which is insane yes 
just from starting off selling. That's bigger than the, the uh, it is not. number one chili. That's why I wear this every day to work now. Oh, okay. Every day I wear this to work. I just get dressed, I put my robe on. Road Trek, and get I just... him a shirt that says number one. <laughs> why hasn't anybody done that? What is up with that? Yeah, I need one that says flying W dealer. I need one that says number one oh, in the state of Florida. You want me to keep going? Yeah. Well, I could be your agent. <laughs> I got you. I'm in. Okay. So what is the deal? So, though? I so know... Road Trek, Road okay. Trek has been in business since the 70s. Mm -hmm. They have made some really cool, innovative, the first, the first class B to do lithium. Mm -hmm. First class okay. B to do a lot of stuff. So lithium was really Road Trek's thing that they started in 2014. Everyone now does it in 2022, right. eight years later. But Road Trek really was the first one to start the battery powered things. Right. You know, which is really neat. Before that, everyone just did Onan generators. So, yeah. so Road Trek has a great history. They did kind of hit a speed bump, 2020 ish, mm -hmm. uh, 2018. 2018, they kind of hit a speed bump, went out of business. They went bankrupt and then they got bought by Rapido, which is a French company that does the Westphalia, the really, really cool yeah. class B's over in Europe and yeah, in France. Iconic overseas. Iconic stuff yeah. over there, huge. Mm -hmm. And so they, they have come back in full force, two year warranty, phenomenal lithium system. I mean, everything is top notch with everybody else. So they've, okay. they've done a great job. So, check out. so just, you know, for the folks out there who maybe this is like, you know, this could be the first time they're looking at Road Trek. Yep. Do they only do ProMaster? Or? They only do Class Bs. So okay. they, they do ProMaster and a, a short Mercedes, a 144. Oh, okay. Um, and, yeah. and yeah. So, so they, you can have the Sprinter if you want. You can have a Sprinter or you can have a ProMaster. They don't okay. do anything on Ford. They are releasing a brand new model of the two at the Tampa Super Show. Okay. Brand spanking new, never been seen. The first one ever will be at Tampa. Ooh. Okay. It's pretty Interesting. cool. Okay, so we're in this video, we're gonna talk about what's happening at the show and everything. Yeah. But let's kick everything off with what's going on here with Road Trek and these Zions okay. and the color. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so <laughs> because there's some interesting colors so, here. <laughs> so back in the '90s and early 2000s, yeah, right. all RVs had colors on them. Uh -huh. Now, since then, 2014, they all have just been body color. They've all just been silver or white or gray. So mm -hmm. Road Trek said, you know what? We're going to bring back some of that retro, some of that vintage look, and start adding some color to them again. So this one, yep. this is a Zion Slumber. Yep. So Slumber has the pop top. This has the silver bottom. It has a silver pop top, silver air conditioner, so all the trim, all the cladding is silver, which is really neat. Yeah. You know, very kind of incognito. You know, yeah. if you look at something like a Nova here, right. it's silver, but it has the plastic cladding. If you look at your yeah. at your Beyond, it's silver, the cladding. This is white with silver, so something that nobody yeah. else is doing. So so when we look Two at the tones. others, they have a big pop of color. This has a very demure very subtle. pop of color. Very and subtle. And probably my favorite in the color scheme. <laughs> You're more of a because it fits in that stealth. Yes. Yeah. It yeah, does. It know. does. I'm very shy this and is, introverted. This is. You know, one of the things yeah. that that we are going to do in this video also is mm -hmm. I want people's opinions. I want to okay. know what do you think? Do you like the what silver? Do you like the mm -hmm. other two colors we're about to show you? So yeah. please be honest, be polite, yeah. but be honest. Right. And and let us know really which one's your favorite one. What do you think about color? Or would you rather it just be be all white just one color. all silver yeah. just one color yeah. so very cool one unique thing about the zion slumber mm -hmm. is that it does have the same floor plan as the regular zion okay. but it's the only pop top that has a full lithium system okay so winnebago does not offer a full lithium a lot of the other ones they don't offer the 600 amp hour lithium batteries that road trek does to a pop top. when it comes to a pop top oh, so okay. road trek has the Zion floor plan with the pop top and a full lithium. So it has solar, underhood generator, full lithium, everything that you would expect in a lithium 3000 watt inverter, all of that in a in a pop top, which is okay. which is pretty unique. So it was kind of like my chili. It had the flavor, the meat, <laughs> the beans, uh, it, it had the cornbread was built in. I mean it had everything. I never, I never tasted and, your chili. I don't know anything about everything. I don't know chili. anything about this, this chili. Like, this so. is like the the chili champion has yeah. it all in one package. Let's uh, let's ask this question, right? Yes. So who buys a pop top from you? So, and I've got something I want to add, but I yeah. want to hear who buys it. Yeah. From you. So yeah. so we sell to a lot of grandparents that okay. that have grandkids that mm -hmm. go with them twenty percent of the time, ten okay. percent of the time, mm -hmm. and then when the pop top's closed, it doesn't affect anything. Okay. It when it's open, you have sleeping for two up there. Mm -hmm. There are more seat belts in the back as well, so you can have seating for four and sleeping for four in this pop top, uh, which which is very unique. 
Yeah. Very unique. Yeah. So let me add my two cents to that. So I think that we've been doing this now for probably like two years. Yeah. So I've been giving my opinion the whole time. And in the beginning, I didn't like a pop top. Mm -hmm. And Lola didn't like a pop, pop top. But we recently had some time with a pop top van. And now I love it, believe me. Any, any new announcements on the Strange family that uh, I need to know about? No, no. But I like a pop top Are you now. Are any kids or grandkids? <laughs> no, we're not. It's so weird. But you know, with, if you have a pop top and you go somewhere that's really picturesque, beautiful, yeah. you can actually go up there and look yeah. at the sunset right. and the sunrise and it's actually fun. I never... You and know. also, you know, also, you know, people like twin beds because they like sleeping separate. We sold one of these to a couple the other day uh -huh. that the husband was going to sleep up top, the wife was going to sleep down below. Interesting. And they have okay. separate sleeping situations because of yeah. snoring, who knows, yeah. whatever, you yeah. know. And and so you know that that's that's a real unique way of using it. Have right. two separate sleeping situations. Yeah, pop top is not bad. No, I, I'm I like growing. It. I like it. What do you think I about have that? Four, I have four kids, right. and so my four kids would never be up able there. To, I, I yeah. just took my four kids on a family vacation. <laughs> oh my gosh! I have an 18 year old. So if you know anything about 18 year old Hank, uh, oh you know, I know. They use the term "I'm 18" all yeah. the time, and they use "bra." Do, do your kids go "bra" a lot? Like, they just go "bra," "bra." <laughs> That, no, I, all I kept hearing from 18 was, Daddy, I'm 18. Uh, uh, until you can support yeah. yourself at the lifestyle yeah. that you are accustomed to living, I don't care exactly. if you're 25. Yeah. You, you, you could be you 50. You are a child in my house. You yes. are a child. Agree. Agree. You are a child. All right, do we want to look at anything else on this? Um, no. So, you know, okay. inside, just like the Zion, it's a slumber, mm -hmm. has air conditioner, it has the 600 amp hour lithium. Um, yeah, I mean, we, we can pop we can this open, open it up here in the back if you guys want to take a look. I'll roll in some in footage 2015, too for anyone who wants to see. In 2015, uh -huh. this was a very innovative floor plan that Roadtruck yeah. came out with, mm -hmm. and still to this day, nobody really makes it. This is a power sofa on one side. Very this cool. Is, this is a fixed um, platform bed, bench on the other. There are seat belts on this side. Yeah, the full bathroom. We're going to go through a Zion. Yeah, we'll show you guys so, uh, full things. But I like the fact, so this scissors, is it's it powered in it scissors and becomes one big thing. Yeah. The one we're going through is this exact floor plan. Very cool. That's, yeah. that's awesome. I so, like that. Yeah. Seats four, sleeps four, Zion slumber. Yeah, and you now, guys will see there's different interior options, even though we're doing the exterior right now. Let's go to the far one. Let's skip okay. the okay. middle one. We're going to come back to this. Uh, look, this at the, is, look at the mintiness. Uh, we call it sage in sage. the fashion oh, world. Oh, oh. Sage, oh, willow oh. sage. And what's this? this what's is, this called? Uh, North Carolina Tar Heel Blue. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is blue. Right. Um, so, you know, this yeah. is a little bit of a louder color, not so subtle. Uh -huh. This this is their, the blue that they're offering. This is a Road yeah. Trek Chase. Just okay. another floor plan that has twin beds in the back, the full bathroom is kitchen this a little all that. shorter nope um, okay. same. same size okay. same this is a pro master okay. these are the upgraded pro master chassis by the way with all the new safety new features um nice. this does have the full lithium package as well 600 amp hours solar 3000 watt inverter underhood Who generator the lithium on these uh so road trek kind of sources their own lithium oh, okay. package and puts it all together okay uh very unique uh lithium so uh, 600 amp hour system's great Absolutely. I think that's like a minimum, yeah. me personally. Yeah. You can run the air conditioner for yeah. hours. Yeah. Lots of cool and stuff. So we're looking at the exterior. You guys can tell us what you think. Yeah, What's your I would thoughts? love to know. This is RV number two. So RV number one is yeah. a silver bottom. Right. RV number two is the blue yeah. bottom. And let's blue. let's kind of walk them around and a show blue them. blue bottom. So we got the blue bottom. Right. We got, you know, some of the different, the wheel wells. Right. And it says Chase right there. This is a Road Trek Chase. This okay. has a little different of a floor plan we'll peek at it real but this is the um, twin beds this doesn't yeah. need to go here this kind of just goes anywhere oh i see okay so twin beds you can walk between them these go up and down just like that this so do all of these beds do this that little pop all of the right chase here? beds do yes all of the chase okay yep so very okay. thick so i mean this yeah. is six inches thick nice cushion nice cushion oh, yeah. oh. no seat Perfect. belts no seat belts oh just twin beds okay this can be one big bed so those things go in the middle and they make one big bed this is a new interior color i forget okay. what they call it, like a white sand or i uh, like that uh leather color though that's really yes. nice on this yeah yeah yeah, yeah. real yeah. real sharp road check has done a great job recently about upgrading their their color scheme so not just yeah. the outside but also the inside the brown leather 
yeah. the nice the nice color things here and we'll go over it i love their yeah. rear shade we'll go over it in the other one and um and this one the upfront seats i'll roll that in are yep. also this color they are they so are. i might like the the interior of this i think is nice the exterior i think is very specific it is i think specific. that it, yeah you have to have like very specific tastes like you're saying if you have if you're a fan of a team that has this color or you know this is this is a uh, like a retro vintage color you know mm -hmm. this this blue people really like yeah it is like 50s art deco style yeah yeah and that's a that's a you know mm -hmm. lots going back to that you know a lot in the fashion world's going back to that mm -hmm. um you know we we're we were in London this past week with my kids. I brought them to Hank. Isn't that where you're from? Uh, I used to live in England. Yeah. Where in England? I used to live in London. Where? I used to live in London. I used to live London? in London. Where's that? Yeah, London. London. That's where you went to. London, England. London, not London. <laughs> London. That's where I lived. It's yeah. not London. I lived in Tooting. I lived in Tooting back. I went to school in Eng in London really? and everything. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, I had a British accent when I came to America. Speak British. Let me see. I can't do it anymore. I, you know. <laughs> so we the would far always rock ask, away took it out of me. We would always ask our 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 Uber <laughs> yeah. drivers or tour guides yeah. to speak English. Oh. And Oh. Or American yeah. English. So and they would always try their accents. It was <laughs> it was really funny. <laughs> One of my cousins came to visit. And he kept asking his mom for a glass of water. He said, Mommy, can I have a glass of water? So there you go. That's the, all you get. The but if tea, I'm, that was, that was yeah. The teas are silent over there. It's funny. It is yeah, get funny. a cup. You want a cuppa? A what? A cuppa. That's like a cup of tea. Oh, cup. The, the, the British believe like tea is the solution for everything. It was actually good. I've never been a big tea drinker. I actually yeah. enjoyed it. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. But yes. I started saying that because what? we went to the Vic victoria and albert museum uh -huh. and they had a big fashion display mm -hmm. and a lot of the fashions from the 50s 60s 70s my kids being 18 and 16 they're like that is so cool look at these cool clothes yeah. i would wear that today oh boy so the stuff from the 50s and 60s <laughs> yeah. and 70s they're coming back that's true today yeah and it's the same thing in this uh, tight tight jeans bell bottoms <laughs> that is true this coloring is not really vintage right. but this outside is and you know yeah uh, and this let's is open here and show people these seats this looks cool yeah. man this very i think goes really well with this van i really like that yeah very unique yeah i love these seats and the and color this has, and like i said the upgraded chassis right. stuff with the big screen this has the the uh all all the push button start the charging the phone everything yeah. everything that we've shown so it just doesn't have the exterior front end the new like that Travada we did a video on. Yeah. yeah but everything you're getting it inside right so correct everything good yeah so now this is rv number two let's okay. let's jump out yeah i want to say that i think when you guys look at these colors i you know i'm not a super fan of the color schemes on the outside i think yeah. that probably women and i know if people get mad at me for being sexist will like this more mm -hmm. but i would like this if it had graphics on it okay because i think if, that's why i like the silver one yeah because that kind of goes with everything that's going on this kind of pops out this definitely pops yeah but i think if there was graphics in there which this makes it easy to do and like maybe you some don't have to do, stripes, yeah, you don't have to do a bunch of swirls but like yeah look at this dynamax asada here right there's yeah. some nice graphics on it that aren't like yeah. loud and in your face but they're yeah. nice and you know fancy yeah. so so this they kinda, don't look bad they right. look, don't look bad it's right. just for a very particular taste so okay. so, so now right. we're going to go on to rv number three so this is the zion peppermint willow sage is what roadshed <laughs> calls it and they said it's the color of the year I don't know if that's in Canada or the U.S. No, no, no. or North America. I don't know. Okay. Um, it's the color of the year, but this is cool, right? So uh -huh. it is kind of muted. It is. It is. It's like a. Pep it's not peppermint's blue. What are you talking about? <laughs> peppermint is not blue. It is not. Winter green is green. If you get oh. a peppermint okay. thing, you get a blue thing of mints. If you get the winter green, you get green. This yeah. is more. I pro If I had to choose between this, the green, and that blue. I probably would like this. Yeah. yeah. I like how they even did the stickers in the. Uh, yeah, yeah, the stickers of that, and then I know they went all out. They went I all out. I know this was the shade. the shade. They did the light. They did yeah. the awning. Yeah. And this has some more cool stuff that we. This, so does. this one we're gonna do a complete thing complete on. Complete right? walk around. Okay. So, what's neat? Let me turn it off so we don't hear it. Right. And then you guys can get a look, just a little look. The cabinets. So is that an option? Can anyone yes. with these colors get the cabinets? Yeah. Oh, color wait a second. Look what I found in here. You got a court. Oh, Lord. What is that? Is that my know. trophy? I, I don't know. I don't uh, think so. This, this is the chili. It doesn't look trophy. like it at all. What was this doing in here? 
You're the only guy who has the trophy and the trophies on the on the apron as well. Everywhere we go. Remember when I did the video with the ring on the whole the, oh, the, the championship? If you get a ring like that, that's it. <laughs> I disown you. I don't win many things in my life, Hank. So the things I do okay. win, I like to. I like yeah, to. Congratulations to, make sure. to you. I gotta talk to your guys about how they let all you my, win this. All my let yeah. me win anything. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I think they let you win. Because I know so, your guys cook. You're not the only one that could cook. Actually, my wife had a had had a big oh, hand in my oh, chili. Oh, here we go. I get the credit. Tr the truth is coming out. I get out credit where credit's due. Because I know Corey could cook, and I know you've got other guys here yeah, that could cook. They can. It's just yeah. I beat them all. Um, oh. So <laughs> this is RV number three. Right. This is the road. This is a 2023 Road Trek Zion. Mm -hmm. This does have the Willow Sage accent. They call it. Okay. And this has like a light gray leather. This oh, is on good. the new ProMaster chassis. Mm -hmm. Um, big screen, push button start, nine speed transmission, all the safety all features. All the new stuff, interior that, wise. Okay. All the new stuff that they come with. And check out these cabinets. Can you, yeah. can you really get that in your, in your video, the color of these cabinets? I hope it's coming across because actually I like the, it's this, cool. I like this interior color more than anything. Oh yeah, a hundred percent. Yeah. And it's, I think you, you said that your wife would love it. I think my yes. mom would like this too. Yes. hundred yeah. percent. Yeah. My wife would like this. Mm -hmm. This is a Willow Sage. You know, my wife's an interior go, designer. Right? That's her job. That's what she does. Right. And her she, job is having to put up with your craziness. That is true too. But that's the bigger job. <laughs> oh, I told you the day I wanted to have more kids. She told me oh. I, was, I was really crazy. Our youngest is 12. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she told you me want another. Really you want, how many kids do you want brawing you that, in the future? As many as oh, God right. will give me. As many as God will give me. <laughs> yeah. Um, but she did veto that. Um, yeah. But mm -hmm. she is an interior designer, and her comment about RVs is always they look so old. They look so, like, <laughs> not true. cool. I showed her a picture of this, and she was. That's really neat. It is. I like it, that it's color. Nice. Yeah, this, so, this makes the whole inside So this has the pop. Mary Schmidt interiors approval. I, yes. I should make a little sticker. So oh, very, very unique, actually. And, and cool. I got to tell you, I'm a big fan. I like that there's big. a, looks like, that's a stainless steel kick plate there, right? Yes. Is that stainless steel or wood? Yeah, stainless steel. Oh, nice. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. this has, you want to get started on the front and work our way yeah. back? Yeah. Okay. So like so, you said, this, so these seats... Um, so how many kind of options do you have on seats in a road track? Do you have, because I noticed the other seats were a different color as so well. So the seats typically come with the the color scheme you pick. So, okay. so this is, this is obviously the Willow Sage color scheme, but, but they have this, this new like uh, white sand cabinetry. Okay, um, the jets are strafing us today, man. The jets are everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> we might be doing some practicing, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, yeah. so this, this is a very unique color scheme but what's really nice is oh, nice. Yep. is is this is the whole new front end the whole this is the 10 inch screen that has the apple car play yeah. it, it has satellite radio everything i really like this stuff and uh i haven't done the video yet nick uh surprise surprise oh. but you remember you you let me borrow oh for man. a very limited time a Tramato. A, a completely new chassis. You haven't done that outside. video yet? I haven't edited it. No, I haven't. <laughs> but guess what, though? What? Th this interior is beautiful, man. It's yeah. awesome. I, yeah, I like, I, yeah. I like how it it all flows and matches. Yeah. Um, I, this I, is like, like I your love, wife was saying design. This yeah. is design in here, yeah. I love the new ProMaster chassis. Yeah. I gotta tell you. I, yeah, they look great. I, I like how it drives being a nine-speed transmission. Yeah. I like how it has the, the electronic power steering. I like how every how everything feels different. It's redesigned. The push button start, the digital dash, the big screen, mm -hmm. the wireless charging pad. Yeah. I like keeping my keys in my pocket when I walk up to the car, press yeah. a button, doors unlock. It's so easy. Now I don't I've got um I've got an iPhone. So yeah. I'm not sure about uh, Android. Is that what the other thing's called? I have no idea. I've never used it. No, one. it's called Android. But you know what? Very easy to connect to. Yeah. This is one of the easiest cars to connect to, I noticed. When we hooked up to it, so yeah, um, I think that's great. I love these uh, these new rear view mirrors. So the digital rear view mirrors, yeah. so they go on and off, and you can also adjust them, go up and down. Yeah, those are very cool. Sh can I go around and show how much leg room you have in here in this one? Yeah, of course. Yeah, let me let me come out and I'll flip around and meet you in the front. So here you guys can see that uh, peppermint. Whatever Nick says about, uh, what did he call this? Willow Ash Sage. Oh, there it is. Yeah, Willow Sage. So there you go. There's Nick, who is uh, six foot tall. Six foot tall. Plenty. I'm not even. 
I'm not there. Are no. you all the way back? I am okay. now. I'm all the way back. I mean, I would actually drive a little closer. I would drive right, right, yeah, right around here. So yeah, so I think up. this is the biggest thing the bigger guys like yeah. us, like me, are concerned about. How did you um, like it when you drove it? Uh, I'm going to say that it did. I wish it had more room. For me personally, Lola loved this, yeah. but you know, Lola is a Lilliputian. You know, you she's know, a little warrior queen. Little, yeah, <laughs> very. The key word, little. <laughs> no, but I had room. I had room in here, but it's not like I think. You know, like a Sprinter or a, uh, the uh, Transit has uh, more room. Yeah. But yeah, so I think that's the one thing. But you know, you could be a big guy and get in there, as you hundred percent. Hundred percent. I'm probably a little bit bigger than Nick. <laughs> Lots of. <laughs> Lots of cool functions in the new. I don't Pro have Master. any awards, but I'm bigger. <laughs> I mean, I'm the champ. Yeah. Just call me right. the champ. You don't have to say Nick. Oh anymore. no way. Just say the champ. <laughs> Just say the champ. Um, so yeah, so right. so really cool stuff. Yeah. All new, redesigned front end yeah, on I this. Love this. I All love this. new yeah. everything. And then you know, Road Trek does a great job, kind of incorporating all of this with their redesign mm -hmm. of. There's a new fridge in here. They've upgraded their lithium, and we'll kind of talk about that as we. Yeah. As, let me let me flip back as that we way. Jump back. There you here. go. Let's see. Oh Lord. Where should we keep this, Hank? I think there's good. That's that's. Oh, are we on video right now? Yes. <laughs> oh, I didn't know. <laughs> okay. Oh, what is this? What I see right here. Right. <laughs> you know, it's not cool. Everyone blames me. For what? For, for the interruptions in the video. There's no interruptions. They blame me for all the hammery. This guy is not a ham. Not at all. There's no he, interruptions. He's not a ham. It's just a chili cook-off uh, yeah. trophy. Yeah. All I, mean, I hear, oh, why do you keep interrupting the guy? It's just a chili cook-off <laughs> thing. Okay. So, okay. Right. so, Road Trek Zion, 2015, they yep. started making these. Yep. This was the, one of the first Should coaches. Yes, I'm just yep. turning some batteries on. Oh, you are? Okay. This is one of the first coaches that was made on the ProMaster chassis in 2015. Um, definitely a unique floor plan. When I met the the higher ups from rapido from mm -hmm. france when they came over we were actually their first north american dealer that they signed up when they when they kind of went back into business and, and started signing dealers up we were the first one to sign up with them that's cool it's kind of a big deal they had like a big photo session a mm -hmm. big write-up about it so we believe in the product we believe in the company but one of the things i asked them was do you plan on changing the zion floor plan because mm -hmm. it's really cool Mm -hmm. And people really like it. And they said, no, the Zion floor plan is a phenomenal floor plan. And then we're going to keep it. So I was really happy to hear that. Mm -hmm. um, and they've they've done some cool stuff with it as well. So so now, you know, the Firefly on the whole thing. So oh, they, that's cool. So they have Firefly that controls everything. You can use your um, app. You can use the did screen. Did the other ones have Firefly? Back when they first started, no. They didn't have Firefly ah, back then. Okay, that's a cool. I like having a digital display like this. Yes. So I know some people don't, but I love that man because you get to see everything. You can get on it with an app. You can yep. control everything. Whole nine yards. Yeah, no, yeah. it is. It That's is great. Awesome. The the other cool thing, you know, a mm -hmm. few things that I point out to everybody. Okay, is, let's switch this way. Is is that mm -hmm. we have? Well, I'll I'll jump in the bathroom as well. Yeah. But something that people really like is this area here. So mm -hmm. this is a really cool. It's like a light grayish fridge. It, yeah, it's kind of a matte. It, yeah. because of this retro yeah. look with these with these cabinets That's with the colors cool. yeah. with the seat colors this this actually looks really neat it looks it like does. a retro fridge but mm -hmm. what people like is that it's a big it's bigger vertig and up high Vertry Frigo. So your know. freezer is up top freezer is up top fridge is down below mm -hmm. but you know what's nice Hank I I I've noticed a lot of RV Class Bs put the fridge on the ground. Yes. So when it's on the ground, one thing that I get comments a lot from mm -hmm. the older generation is that it's hard to get things out of the back of the fridge wow. or the freezer because well, you have to so, bend down to get yeah, in there. Bend all yeah. the way down to yeah. get in there and all that. Mm -hmm. And so and so you know if you can minimize that bending and that using, this is nice because they elevate the fridge yeah, up even, off the ground. Yeah, you know even we're not spring chickens either. But this, I you know even as a middle aged or whatever we are, middle aged. <laughs> Don't say we. I'm a lot younger than you. Oh, sure. Okay. Well, that's true. Just because I'm uh, old doesn't mean I'm old. <laughs> but this is a good. I like so, this layout. This is another thing. Oh, this wow. is a, a nice. pots and pans drawer big, yeah. so nice big drawer mm -hmm. people love this you don't see a drawer this size in many class brvs nope um this is a, something else that's pretty cool Ooh, i like this this is a pantry so yeah. you can use it for a lot of things people use it for mm -hmm. shoes they use it for clothes they use it for cereal they use spices, it for spices whatever. they use it for yeah. cool. all speaking of spices i had some of the best indian food in london last week 
Oh, th- I think someone dude. told you that when you were going to England, right? Some of the yeah, some of the best Indian food I ever yeah. had. That's what I was telling you, man. It was so uh, good. Yeah, so England good. is one of the best places outside of India <laughs> for Indian food. Yeah. Um, so you know, uh-huh. nice big pantry, nice big drawer, double door fridge. That's, that's elevated. So yeah. all of this stuff is really unique. Yes. Um, something else that's we cool. Do, we don't. We do not see that often when we look at vans. Do not. No, we don't. don't. Yeah, and I like it. Okay. Something else that's cool is is uh, why is that trophy keeping in our way? Move this. <laughs> Something else yeah. that's cool is if, if you're washing, let's say you're washing a plate that's this size, mm-hmm. it actually fits in here to wash it and use it. You know, it has it has the bigger sink okay. that kind of gives you room to put stuff in here. So big bowls, okay. pans, all that. Mm-hmm. Uh, some sinks are real small, so they just kind of do this. And so it's hard to get stuff underneath them. Oh, I see. Okay. See what I'm saying? Yeah. So so the people really like this. It also kind of comes oh, out. Oh, that's nice. I like that. And, yeah. And, and you can use it in, in different ways. That I like. That's different. So, and I like that. Pretty yeah. pretty cool there. I like, I the, like all the stainless steel backsplashery that's happening. It's neat, huh? Yeah. So induction stove. Wow, cool. You know, they did something else. They did all these cabinet doors in this willow sage color. I heard this is a color of the year. Did I tell you that already? Uh, yes, totally. You did. Did I also tell you that I was the chili cook-off champion at, uh-huh. at uh, Sunshine State <laughs> RVs in 2022? Yeah. Okay. Congratulations. <laughs> uh, drawer. Is this a drawer? Oh, yeah, you did show that. So, you showed oh, look at that. Nice. Matching. Uh, pretty matching pillows. Yeah, matching so, pillows. So this is the armoire. So the armoire, you can hang clothes. You can put stuff in here. Okay. Lots of space. This is all the stuff that comes with it. Um, okay. You you skipped over the microwave here. The miniature microwave, I call yeah, it. This is go. kind of miniature. So, so just microwave. No just special microwave. things. We just skipped the bathroom the too, Hank. We need to yeah. we need to jump back yeah, in there. Let's go back. I like the lights that we see in here. These yeah, look so, good. So you know it's cool. Check that out. Yeah. They're you just touch it. You just touch it. That's awesome. But also you can use the Firefly and turn them all off. Uh, are they dimmable off. through the Firefly? They're not dimmable. No. Oh, okay. All right. Cool. Good to know. Um, pizza oven. Pizza oven right here. Let's see. Give it a chance so you guys can see that. Let me jump in here. And the bathroom. So, very neat. So, this is a side bath. People do like these. Okay, um, let's see. Stand up straight. Let's see. Six foot tall. You can stand up straight in there. 232 Suck pounds. It in. <laughs> Lean, mean, fighting machine. <laughs> yeah. So, but you're going to want to probably sit down. Lots of space-ish. Yeah. Um, can you get your head into this? This sink looks, yeah, this yeah. decent size. Separate sink, yeah. shower head, you have a light in here, which is nice. You have a nice mirror. big mirror. You have a, uh, a towel rack here. You have oh. toilet paper here. So something interesting I'm noticing, why, why does, you know, why are there these tabs in the door? Can you remove these? So these are, me- this is the mirror. Oh, the mirror is back there, of so course. The- okay, yeah. So I guess is yes. Reflection. You can re- Oh, that's cool. You can remove the mirror. Oh, nice. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. nice like place yeah. for shampoo. You get to move around. Mm-hmm. So yeah, I like this bathroom. Yeah, so even Good if you size. broke the mirror or something, you can still service it and put another Correct. mirror in there. Correct. Very nice. And lots of mirror space, which I know people, yeah. especially my wife, is very and, concerned about. And this, oh, people buy those little suction cup things and they put little suctions yep. everywhere. Yep. Awesome. And then and they hang stuff from it. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. I like this. So neat. We, we didn't really do much on the outside. So there is a macerator and a gravity pump. So for whatever reason, the macerator, when you press the button, it pumps the the waste out it doesn't work there is a gravity backup which is really nice oh, that's great macerators are awesome in these vans makes it they are fun. they're not awesome when they don't work <laughs> yeah nothing is <laughs> nothing is is that so do all of these um the road tracks have that yes. or oh yep. nice all okay. of them have that oh that's great so yeah, yeah yeah really that's like an upgrade on a lot of different vans it that is, we look it at. is a lot okay. of vans do not have that yeah very cool uh there's is that a max fan there this or? is a dometic fan okay so it opens power it, it turns on and off all that so there, okay. i think there's a remote somewhere for it cool i don't have you know i mentioned the lithium system you mm-hmm. know what's what's really neat about these lithium systems is that everything in the code can work and power without being plugged in with being off the grid being on the side of a mountain being on on the side of a beach wherever you're at everything in the van can work for four five six eight hours mm-hmm. so so really unique setup that that is a is makes camping and not having to find camping spots or campgrounds 
very, very easy. And, mm -hmm. and I think that's why the Class B market is exploding the way it is because you can drive this thing really easy. You can move it anywhere in the country you want to go. You just pull over, you, you camp, and then mm -hmm. and that's it. You know, we, we sell these people all over the country. And, mm -hmm. and that's what everyone says is that, man, I'm looking for a Class B so I have the freedom and the flexibility of not having to go to campgrounds. I agree. Absolutely <laughs> love that. So, yeah. so we actually deliver these anywhere in the country, deliver mm -hmm. them everywhere. And whenever we do, people are just like, oh, I'm just so excited to be able to go the West Coast, East Coast, North, yeah. the Upper Peninsula of Michigan, or yeah. wherever your hotels go. with you, You're hotels your with hotel you, room with you, everywhere you go. Yeah. So, so I really, I noticed. Uh, there's a couple of things I noticed here. I really like this panel that they have here. Yeah. Um, this is a. It feels interesting. So I there's some know. insulation. So uh, okay. insulation behind it. This is cool. Um, it's soft. It's comfortable. It kind of yeah. gives you that that nice feel inside. Yeah. Of it. Yeah. I really like that. I don't often see a roof treatment like this. You yeah. Know? Yeah, it's unique. It yeah. is. It is definitely unique. Very deliberate. And then, obviously, the the cabinets back here also have that green. Let's open it because people will complain if we don't. Oh, we show call them it a uh, willow sage what? tank, not green. Willow sage. Okay. At some point, I will remember that. Uh, willow more sage. here. More here. More, more here. everywhere. Open little one there. there nice big go. one here. This, yep. is, this is the the shades for the front, maybe. Oh, cool. And oh, so and then you've got sunshade. like. Uh, connections in here yep so this comes with a smart tv uh -huh. if you want to have an internet router we can we can hook it up in here if you want to have a dvd player uh, an apple tv a roku all of that can can be in here which people really like that as well yeah and then there's looks like a dometic uh, AC it is probably. this has a dometic um road track just started going to the truma haventi the new truma air conditioner that that, that we, we like we yeah. love the truma so air road track is starting to do that now they are yep, oh. yep. is that this, from, this, from this year this is is, that's from right now. So everything oh, that ships sweet. after now is going to have the new Truma air conditioner. Oh, that's it. awesome. I, very, very yeah. cool. So I really like that. Coachman yeah. has it, and now mm -hmm. Road Trek is getting it as well. Oh, that's great. So what's funny, you know, we talk about the Tampa show. Last mm -hmm. Tampa show, you did a, a like kind of an unveiling and intro to right. the new Truma air conditioner. Yes. If people want to see that, it's still here, and it's a really good air conditioner. It is really, it is. really good. Built-in dehumidifier, yeah. all, all kinds yeah. of stuff. Yeah, they made it into. They had an honorable mention in our top five things from last year when Lola and I talked about it. Nice. That you know, uh, Truma and Coachman, you know, getting yeah. that as the exclusive yeah. for last year. Yeah, so congratulations cool. to them. You know, something I like is that the way they did this, so this is different than their typical cabinetry. Mm -hmm. This is this is like a flat with some lines in it. So it kind of has that modern retro feel to it. Mm -hmm. And if you feel feel that, Hank, it's like a matte finish. Really yeah, it is a matte it. finish. Um, See, so that can be real easy to clean. Or, yeah, it has like almost a rubbery soft yeah. feel. Just like I was saying about up here, I really like the materials that they're using in here. That's interesting. It and is, these, these are built in Canada? They're built in Canada. This feels European, doesn't it? Yeah. I, I mean, like between this and that and, and a lot of yeah. the feel, it feels European. So as we're going, let me open this. Let me some. flip around and come around that side. Oh, we're going to look, look at the beds, right? Perfect. There we go. You guys get to look at this again, the color. The, uh, so show them number two. Number two, which is uh, some kind of, what is it, baby blue? Baby I'm going to say baby blue. And this is like a minty fresh That's more like the blue green. suede shoes. This is more <laughs> like the the willow sage, the Pantone color of the year. I like the gray so, seating here, too. You can really see the gray yes. popping off of this. Yeah. yeah. Can you see this? Is this in the way? Should I take this off? Or here we go. Uh, here are you go. good? Yeah. Where it says champion. Is All that right. good? Okay. All right, this okay. isn't in the way, is it? No, you're good. Right. <laughs> so, look at that. It looks good. This color scheme looks great. The inside. unique floor plan. Yeah. A lot of people have twin beds, right? Mm -hmm. You know, Coachman makes a nice twin bed model. Mm -hmm. They call it the, the rear bath, the Coachman uh, Beyond D. Right. You know, Winnebago makes a twin bed model. American Coach makes it. Everyone makes a twin bed model, right? Mm -hmm. What's unique about this Road Trek twin bed model is that one side has seat belts. So, mm -hmm. there's seat belts here. Also, when you press the button, extend. I love this. It folds it out. Awesome. To make. I think more people should do this. <laughs> to Ooh. make a big bed. So, big bed. Oh, and there's still a space here. Very, very intentional, uh -huh. Hank. Oh, okay. Because if you want to sleep here, uh -huh. you can lay down and sleep here. Mm -hmm. Someone else can sleep there. Right. And then you, if you get out of bed, it's tight, but you, you can get room. up, get out of bed, go to the bathroom. Ah. Uh, okay. You're not stuck. Okay. If you don't, if you want to have one big bed, mm -hmm. there is a thing that slides out. Oh. 
Here, you want me to hold this up? Nope. Oh, nope. I Slides see. Out. Oh, interesting. Now we got. I like that. The whole king size bed. So if you're by yourself, you could have your bed come out and be bigger than this one would be. Correct. And you could store a bunch of stuff over here if you wanted to. You could. But if you're with your significant other, you yep. could go full bed size. That's awesome, man. Isn't that neat? So then when you're done, it. you slide that back. Yeah. That's slide cool. Slide that. Drop it down. This Very is my favorite. This is unique, isn't it? Yeah. I really, I like this. <laughs> Listen, the thing. They've been making yeah. this since 2015. Yeah. Nobody else has copied it. I'm not saying I don't they know. should. Is it illegal this to is copy? Great. Copy no. this, Van Everybody people. can do it. This is yeah. great. Yeah, I love it. So, no. something else that everybody loves, Hank. Uh -huh. Everybody loves this about the Zion. Uh-oh. You got one. Drawers. Two. Oh. Three. Wow. Four. This is actually pretty awesome. <laughs> five. Oh. <laughs> Six. Wow. So you have six drawers. That is cool, man. All independent of each other. Mm -hmm. All locking drawers right there. Wow. Tell me what other RV you see has that kind of storage in it. I, I can't. This is. I really like this layout, man. Tell me who else you know is a chili cook-off champion. No one. Exactly. No one. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. I'll give that to you because of the drawers. Thank you. So, so very unique. Yeah. Lots of drawers. That's fantastic. Um, power folding bed. Very cool. Yeah. Seat belts. This is what has made the Zion, I mean, the, the the most innovative Class B in 2015 when it came out, and why they're still making it seven, eight years later, exact same floor plan. Every other company, they So all of them change. have this, or? All of them. All of them. Wow, that's cool. Okay. Now, they do make one floor plan that has a front-facing sofa, so it's just like okay. everything else with a sofa, okay. and it obviously doesn't have all this. Yeah. But what I love about this is this storage. Yeah. Is that's the fantastic. beds. So if you wanted to, you could upgrade your lithium, which I know we have a video. Like if, if folks want to do the up lithium yep. upgrade. Yep, you can upgrade right. to more than 600 amp hours. Okay. But, you know, before we move on to the lithium, yeah. you can put bikes in here. Mm -hmm. You can put skis in here. You can mm -hmm. put a canoe. You can put kayaks. I mean, there's yeah. so much. You can put lumber. There's so much you can fit down this middle aisle here. Yeah. And it's and you just bring it right out the back. It's just yeah, a, it makes a these vans really usable. You yeah. know, you could take them to Home Depot or Lowe's or yeah. do a bunch of grocery shopping yeah. and stuff like that in here. And look you at know, this. This is even a little green. Can you see that in the... Yeah, I can. It's awesome. So how do these windows work? So here? this is the nighttime shade. Okay. This is the daytime shade. Oh. And then they slide all the way open like oh, that. Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah. Pretty yeah. cool. Not life shattering, but cool. No, and I noticed they've got some little speakers back here. Speakers, USB ports. USB, oh, there's lights up here. Nice. Everything that you would want. Did that go on because I went close to it? I don't know how no. the lights work. Okay. Yeah, press it. Oh, there you go. Oh, cool. Okay. And then, yeah. you know, as as we're kind of yeah. moving on out the RV. Let's give it a second here to adjust for lighting. Boom. I mean, okay, they can adjust it right here. Yeah, okay. Here we go. Um, this is the road trek screen and i know we have talked about this before in other mm -hmm. videos i feel like yes this is this is something that road trek makes i've never seen this screen in pretty another, solid in another rv um and there's storage in it too right so that, that, that's yeah. what i was saying so people mm -hmm. put their shoes back here they mm -hmm. put towels they put mm -hmm. sandals all that this is a lot of storage here mm -hmm. what else is cool from the inside so there's a screen here from the inside you can drop the back side down and you can have a screen going through yeah or you can so have you a can nightshade out yeah. yep you can block awesome. it out let, let me go inside and do that yeah. actually also i noticed you got a table back here for everyone who's looking you know th here's a table storage back here some other storage here this one <laughs> this one has the bike racks on it how cool is that yeah can you so see you me can just oh yep can you see my my apron there? No, can't see it now. No? Cannot see that uh -huh. at all. Um, so the table Don't is for the middle here. <laughs> the table is for the middle here, so that way uh -huh. you can have kind of a dinette. Uh, we we had someone buy this the other day, and we installed a second table, and they wanted to have two separate tables. Oh, uh, okay. So, so when you're sitting there. It's got the exact same thing. It's on a lagoon yeah. swivel mount, so we installed yeah. a second table. Yeah, let's lift this up. So, very neat. So once before you lift it up, you got to screw oh. it back in here, or zip it, I'm sorry. Right. If it's there. I could see you, by the way. <laughs> you could or couldn't? I could. I could. Yeah, I could see you. So then, not not as clearly. So I know some people will appreciate being able to actually see you. Eh, only one person I know. Yeah. <laughs> A little short Puerto Rican. <laughs> That's all you need. So then you can. 
all I need. That's all you need. <laughs> so then when it's when you're done, uh -huh. kind of roll it up like this. And then just strap it in. Like that. And it's out yeah. of the way. One. I like this. Yeah. Two. I think you've heard me say it before, more vans should come with this stuff. You yeah. Know, it helps. So so what's nice is you don't have to store window shades anywhere. Mm -hmm. It's all built in. It's all built in there. The screen is built in. The shade yeah. is built in. It's all one. It doesn't yeah. break. You're not sliding it open back and close. You know, it's okay. just it's all it's all one. Um, this also has so Road Trek has a very nice bike rack. So yes, yeah. this, this is a Thule bike rack yeah. and roof rack. So this this actually comes from Road Trek like this. It comes like this. Okay. Yes. And there is, yeah, there is a, I don't know if you guys can see the rack here. There's no ladder back here, but there you go. If you can take a look up there, there is a, is it Thule or Thule? Thule? Uh, is it yeah. Nike or Nike? Uh, I'm going to say Nike, but Nike, right? you know, who yeah. knows. Yeah. Thule? Uh, I noticed the AC is the same peppermint. It's a willow sage, thank you. And so is the satellite. Yeah. The soul, the, the little TV yeah. antenna thing. Yeah. That's, I mean, it. that took some, you know, some doing on yes. their part, right? Yes. So very cool. So very unique. Yep. Road Trek, this will be at the Tampa Super Show in two weeks from now. Two weeks from now. We're going to be there. Hank how will do, be there. How do people find you? Find me. Yes. They Google Chili Champion and then my face just pops up. Yeah, this is gonna be the the RV Super Show, <laughs> not the Super Cook Off Show. Oh no! Okay, so we yeah. will be at Road Trek. So you yeah. know, you go to the Tampa Super Show, right when you walk in, Road Trek is there. You know, okay. so there's a big building that has same the Prevost. Same spot from last year. Same yeah. spot. Okay. So the big building has the Prevost and all those. Yeah, they won't let us look at those big. As expensive soon as you class walk A's. out of that building, we're uh -huh. the first booth on the right. Oh, okay. So we're right there. You, you can see it right out, there. You'll okay. see Road Trek right there. Same place you guys were last same year. Same place we were last year. We'll also have yeah. Coachman. Nova, so that's kind of around the point. Oh, okay. There you but, go. But yeah, Coachman Nova will be there. Road mm -hmm. Trek will be there. This will be there. We deliver for free anywhere in the United States, Hank. Did you know that? Yes, I did. Anywhere in the U.S. You know why deliver? I know that? Why? Because I'm the president of whatever special club you have. You know, so yes, we I started am. the Sunshine State Elite Club <laughs> the week after Hank bought his RV from us. That is how me and Hank met, by the way. Hank walked in one I day. am the president. Him and Lola walked in uh -huh. in their Audi R8. I'm like, oh, geez, here come these rich people. They're never going to buy an RV. And he bought a Beyond uh -huh. from us, and we uh -huh. became friends ever since. Hank right. started a YouTube channel, and, right. and that was going great yeah um but uh -huh. uh we do deliver free anywhere in the country yes we do guarantee service appointments we get right. tech support over the phone with sunshine we've done we do a lot of stuff you, these guys do class b vans that's all we do so if you're into that i know you go up you know got b pluses and we things do. like that but that's what they do so if you guys are looking if you want to actually get in these things and walk around i mean i, I you you have to see what's going on behind me there's, there's a, a lot there's a lot of it how many b vans go into the show so we'll have about 30 going to the show 30 yeah. okay yeah. And we've got some special surprises. We do, and all that. we do. Yeah. The brand new Road Trek mm -hmm. floor plan and model um, that has never been released anywhere. This, this is going to be the first time it got voted yeah. best new release of the year by RV Business. Oh, okay. RV Magazine, whatever yes. it is. Yes. So I'm going to be there. I will spend some time over with Sunshine State RV and I'm going to be moving around. I think the show this year has like a space that they said people can meet you at, you know, for the folks like us. But if you're looking for me. I mean, the coachman if you find that we'll face, do lunch one he day. knows how to find me. We'll we'll have a uh, we'll have a big lunch one day for the sh for Hank and Lola. Yeah, and, yeah. and all of all of his groupies yeah. can come. And, if you uh, bump into me, you could totally you know say Hank, hi. I don't mind. Hank will buy you lunch one day. Yes, I will buy you lunch, and it will be at waiting for you at Sunshine State RV. <laughs> Yes. So you could totally go over there and look for it. Yes. Yes. So no, we will see you out there. Um, anything else we need to tell folks before we get? No, out of just here? Tampa Super Shows coming up. We'll yep. have the road trucks there. Yep. All of these will be yep. there, and some but, other cool stuff we're not going to talk about right now. Yes. Yes. Lots of cool stuff. Lots of cool stuff. So make sure you check out Sunshine State RV if you're looking for this stuff. A big thanks to folks. You know, by the way, at the end, at the end of 2022. We hit 25,000 subscribers. No way. Yes. Congratulations. Yes. Thank you very much. That's a big deal. Yes. Thanks to you guys out there for that. I really appreciate that. It's awesome for me and Lola to see like the growth and everything that's happening with yeah. the channel. You know, I think Sunshine State RV, I'm going to give you a little bit. 
A little bit. Just a little That's tiny right. bit, like a like about the size of so that I don't get an apron trophy. And a trophy? <laughs> yeah. You're not gonna give me an apron. I'll give you a little digital oh. trophy right now. Gotcha. Just hold your hand like that. Boom. There you go. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, we're out of here. Thanks. Thanks, sir. See you on the next one, guys. Peace.